cheese on my left and cheese on my right. Whoa. This keto diet made cheese my life. Whoa. I don't want a grilled cheese, but I can't have no bread. Think I have low carb cheese sticks instead. Click the link to see my cheese stick video, by the way. Swag fab. Your host, yours truly, Jupiter Red, and I am back with another video. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified when I upload a video because I know y'all want to watch me get skinny, don't you? My earrings keep jingling. So, guys. I have officially completed week one of the keto diet. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Lord knows it has not been easy giving up carbs. Like, oh my gosh. How does one simply give up carbs when I am carbs? But somehow I scraped up that willpower and I did it. Must have been the power within. Power within. The power within. The power within. Yeah. So I'm gonna give you a few pros and cons of what I've experienced this past week. And I'm also gonna give y'all a weigh in and before and after pictures. I have tested myself with a ketone strip and yes, I am officially in ketosis. So let's get started on the pros and cons. The cons are, it's really not that filling. A lot of people say, oh my gosh, all the facts are filling. They just make me so full. It's all lies, all lies. I'll be starving like Marvin. Con number two. The amount of fat that you have to eat in one day is so hard to obtain. Like seriously, you have to eat insane amounts of fat. And I believe the amount that you have to eat is between 144 grams of fat and 177 grams of fat. And that is just like, whoa, like, whoa. Con number three is the keto flu. Um, I didn't really suffer from this too, too bad. The only problem that I really had with the keto flu was getting um, headaches and some dizziness. And the final con is the obvious. You can't have pasta. You can't have bread. You can't have rice. You can't have bananas. Like, come on, bruh. You can't have bananas. Bananas are like the staple healthy food. All right, let's get to the pros. Pro number one is I can have lots and lots of cheese. Pro number two is that the pounds just fall off. When I tell y'all how much weight I lost in this week, y'all are either gonna be like, dang, or y'all gonna either be like, that's not healthy. But we'll get to that in a second. The third and final pro is that it's easy to eat out. All you have to do is, you know, take the buns off of burgers, make sure you don't eat no rice, noodles, chips, pasta, and that's pretty much it. Replace all those things with salad, okay? You want a burger? Take the buns off the burger, put it on some romaine or whatever salad preference of your choice. You got a meal. Want a Philly cheesesteak? Make the meat, the cheese, the peppers, and the onions. Put it on some romaine lettuce, you got a meal. Want pizza? You just take the cheese and the pepperoni and you melt it. And I'm not sure that one's gonna work. I guess I should add to the con list that you probably end up eating a ton of salad. All right, now let's talk about how much weight I lost. Unfortunately, I forgot that when you do a weigh-in, you're supposed to show people your original weight, but I'm lame and I forgot to take a picture or a video of my original weight before I started this diet. However, I do know how much I weighed before this diet and you have to take my word for it. I weighed 225 previously and now I weigh 
217. 217. And that's right, guys. That means I lost eight pounds in seven days. That is an incredibly unhealthy amount to lose in one week. But I'm absolutely ecstatic. I can't wait to get to my goal weight. I can't beat because when I get to my goal weight, it's going to be your national holiday. By the way, which is 175. Maybe 165, depending on how I look. But for right now, my short-term goal is to get under 200. And now, the moment that you've all been waiting for. I know it's not that much of a difference, but we take what we can. Eight pounds in seven days. Come on, you can't beat that. That's like a pound point two every day. Well, that is it for today's video. If you like this video and you want to continue watching me lose weight, make sure you shoot that subscribe button and hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload a video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next video. Whoa.